Okay, so this guy's got this mod that he made for Stranded Deep, and I like the mod, but I was going to show him this issue. Um, as soon as you install the mod, this is before 62 frames per second, and that's right at my load state, so that the picture is identical for both instances. This is without the mod. Then here is with the mod cuts my frames in half down to 30. So I want to show him but it is on the Steam forums and it's you can't just upload a photo here. So what I want to do is upload the photo through Steam but you can't upload a custom photo through Steam or can you? So what I'm going to do is fire up the game that I want the screenshot to come from. Okay, so this is the game uh, that I'm referencing to. So I'm in the game. Now I'm going to do one, two screenshots. And then I'm going to close the game. Now it's going to tell me that I have two new screenshots. Alright, now I'm going to tell it show me the screen the screenshot on disk so here's the first one here's the second one now here's the trick and definitely not a lot of people know this because they're not as much of a nerd as I am so what we want to do is open this picture with paint now once we open paint you want to hit control A and that just selected everything you can see a little border box just popped up here now hit control C that just copied that picture. Now I'm going to open up this first screenshot with paint. Now I'm going to hit control V. That just pasted my photo on top of the other photo. Now we're going to click save. Now if you look over here it's my screenshot. So now we're going to do that again with the second shot. Open with paint. Control A. Control C then close it, then open this one, oh, da -dum -dum -dum. open with paint, control V, and then we're going to save that one. Now it's saved on here, but Steam still sees this, so what we're going to do is we're going to exit Steam, and I shouldn't even have to leave this folder open anymore. Now we're gonna go back into Steam and come on. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go here and we'll go to view screenshots. That's Final Fantasy crap. So we're gonna go to Stranded Deep and our screenshots are here. So what I wanna do I really want to check which one's which again. Will it let me see it bigger? Show on disk. I'm not sure which one's which at this point. Hmm. They should be backwards. So I would say this one's the first one, that one's the second one. So here we're going to say before mod. Now we're going to go ahead and upload that. Hopefully that's right. And then here we're going to put after mod. God, I can't type right now. Upload. Upload. Alright. Now, let's see online library. And it didn't change the thumbnail, but that's fine. Okay. This one. Where are the tags on it? Hmm. Zero. Okay. After mod, yeah, 30 frames per second. And then before mod is that. So now what I can do. There's my screenshot, so I can copy 
this. Oh, control C. Then go back here. Vapor mod. And then I can head down. Control V. Let's go two lines down after mod hit enter to go down again let's tab back over to steam oh close you do 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 okay okay after mod we have here control c go back here down, control V, and then post comment. So now there's screenshots that I just posted on his thread about his mod, which is an awesome mod. I like it. And I've got some tricks that I can get my FPS back up, but I'm just showing how it would work for everyone that doesn't know how to get around it. So before 62, after. 30. So yeah, there's uh, some of the nerd stuff that I do and how to upload custom screenshots through Steam, even though you're not supposed to be able to. Alrighty. So, there you go. I gotta do a bias mod on my video card so that I can get my frames back up and still use this guy's mod. Well, take it easy everybody, and just in case, Hopefully that helped somebody. <laughs>